You survived another week. You did it. Chriselle, Chriselle, I think every girl in our age group was jealous of you tonight. Talk about putting good energy out there. Oh my gosh. I, it's so funny. As I was watching you perform, I wrote to myself like a note, ask her, do you think that they're watching your performance tonight? Never did I think <laughs> that they would have a message for you. Every single one of them, honestly, like, how does it feel? What was going through your mind? I'm sorry, we have to skip to this. No, I like, well, that's how I felt. It was almost like it made me a little untouchable with the judging because it was <laughs> like, I, I understand that this is what we're here for, but I have to let you know, this has been, this is like my lifelong dream. <laughs> And I just accomplished that. So to me, that's three tens. I'm sorry. No, it absolutely was. And you have this forever now, a message from every single one of them. I mean, it's insane. Gleb, do you feel like you turned into a new Kids on the Block fan or were you already? He did. Totally. He did. Totally. First of all, I'm digging every single song. Like every time I hear the tune, I was like, oh my God, it's such a good vibe. And before that, I had no idea what the NKOTB is. I was like, what? <laughs> I knew the song and step by step. And now I, loves it. I love it. I love it. You get it. I'm this, a yeah, like, fan. okay, okay, now he's like, in. What? And in the dance, so I was waiting for it the whole time. I said, will they hit the dance move? I love it. It was so good. I mean, even though I know you didn't have the scores that you wanted, it was truly a fun dance to watch. Um, did you feel like maybe you were a little nervous going into this week because of what happened last week with the mix-up? No, to be honest with you, I feel like this week really kind of, you know, I, I was excited. This is the first week I have to say, like, I actually was excited about the dance. So, you know, I, I felt like it was like, I felt the most confident that I, this was the longest dance we'd had and the most moves and also the most where I was on my own without him every second kind of leading me. And so it was the most complicated for sure. And that being said, I was the most confident that I've ever been going into a dance. And I think that comes across in how much fun I was having. Cause if I'm not having fun, the worst part about me is that you see it and I can't really hide it that well. And I think you, you know, that reads every time, you know, in those moments. And so I can't, and so I feel like even Though, yeah, there are things that I have to work on technically for sure. I think that my joy of just having that song and being confident in the cha-cha, you know, I feel like that came across. So, yeah, I was, was happy. You could. You could tell it was fun. It was sexy. You was confident. You could see it all. It was a full circle moment for you. I feel like now whenever you find out whoever you're dancing to this upcoming week, you have to say, oh, they're my favorite. Try to get another message. Like, <laughs> the, the bar is high here. One thing I want to talk to you guys about, Chriselle, you posted this on your uh, social media, but you guys had your first fight and then you sent her roses. What was that about? What was the fight? It's because he wasn't a fan and of look, the kids on the block. You know, I was, it was a lot of Russian came out of me. I was like, I wasn't happy with the dance. I was kind of pissed at the judges because they, in my opinion, overscored us a Fox little tried. bit. Fox tried. I was like, listen, I thought it was a four. That's it. It was oh. a four. Didn't do the step. Didn't do the. This one we didn't see like, you last week, right? So I was like, <laughs> Shelly, that was bad. That was bad. I was like, oh my so, god. And she. You got are tough. Emotional. So yeah, I was. Yeah, I was. So really that's tough. why this week he doesn't. He doesn't. Um, you know, he says it like it is. Like this week, yeah. our scores were low, but he's like, no, you did a great job. Yeah. So I know I can really. I really, you know, that's why after the dance, I knew he was happy. And look, to in, in, in Russian culture, we, we men do give lot, like flowers to women, like to like apologize or whatever. Even like men give flowers to a man sometimes. Really? That's true. Like that's that. true. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's true. So I was like, look, there's a flowers. You know, I, I'm sorry. I was, um, you know, you probably have an account me. set up somewhere where you're just constantly having to give out flowers because <laughs> all that comes out since you say that's what you guys do. That's funny. Um, He's oh, passionate okay. about, you know, dance, which is great. Exactly. But yeah, there's it's going to make you better. Baby, whatever it takes. <laughs> but now I have to blame dance. you. I have to blame you as to why I couldn't talk to Chriselle last week. 
Mm. Let me give you my address in the chat so you can send me some flowers. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. What do you like? Tell me the color. I got not you. roses. And Chriselle can explain that to you later. Why I'm not into roses. I got you, Rachel. I got you. Um, oh, okay. Well, since I brought up roses, okay, before I get kicked out, I got to ask you, The Bachelorette premieres tomorrow. We've been waiting forever for this. How excited are you for Claire? And do you have any advice for her based on what you've seen with the promos, which are crazy? You got to start watching this too. Take your time. Take your time. Well, I would just say, I mean, listen, I know Bachelor Nation was on pins and needles about the Lakers, but they took it home. So, you know, we've got this premiere coming, which is amazing. Um, I just feel like, you know, she certainly doesn't need advice from me, but I just love that she, you know, she knows who she is. And anybody watching this show, we really appreciate that. That's one of the reasons you're my yeah. favorite Bachelorette that's ever been, because you just knew who you were and you, and you felt that. So. I didn't, it's like watching a singer and you get nervous if, if you feel like they may not hit, they might not hit that note. Yeah. And you're, you're so comfortable watching when you know they got it. And there was such a comfortable, you know, when we, I watched you and now watching her, I feel like I can just relax and enjoy it because yeah. she's got this. And I, and that makes it fun to watch. It so, does. It's going to be yeah. wild. It's, it's going to be a wild season. Well, congratulations to you guys. I know you're still on cloud nine. I hope you recorded tonight so you can go back and oh watch it and I soak it wait. all in. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.